another Good rainbow. Good afternoon. We're so glad you're here. <laughs> we daily vlog. Come back tomorrow because we'll post another video tomorrow. I've never seen a rainbow end to end. Goes all the way. Well, there's a pot of gold with somewhere. My name is Peter. I have a YouTube called The Fat Five Two Hundred Seven. Should we post some new videos on The Fat Five Two Hundred Seven next week? Because I'm going to be in Kansas with Dom. You're not going to be in Kansas. You're going to be in Kentucky. And it's Ooh. been forever since we've been in this shop. Yeah, so we're walking through. Thing one, thing two, thing Eve. You know how we always say Harry Potter is a Christmas movie? Proof is in the pudding and snow. I found Sarah's Christmas present. <laughs> If you know down below, plus I'm about to go meet up with some of my friends who should know. But whose wand is this? I don't think I've ever seen it before. I used to get the magazines of all these, and I would like always stare lovingly at the wands. But whose is this? Oh, we're checking out the big fire menu. Look, they have something called a cauliflower steak, which is shishito peppers, roasted vine tomatoes, warm feral salad, charred tomato sauce. That sounds so good. Oh. Chopped kale, baby beets and goat cheese. So I wonder if B means vegetarian and B G means vegan. Oh yeah, maybe. That's nice. Oh. That's so nice. So these are the three different fires that they burn. Cool. That's super cool. We Cherry should go here. We should. For my birthday? For your birthday? <laughs> I mean, we are like vacationing here this week. But I thought we were maybe going to eat those tomorrow with the girls, potentially. We are. <laughs> Put a comment over where that's from. I don't know if this is just naive, Ate, but why is there a stilt walker in Margaritaville? Also, I'm super pumped. I already called Katie to bug her. But Islands right now is looking mighty fierce and delicious. This sky is just beautiful. It rained like right when Peter got home from work. But it's already cleared up, so it just feels good. It's cool, it's a little breezy. We're gonna yeah. get some voodoo donuts. I'm just excited. I I'm, love these people. I know. And, I'm so excited and we to get see a little them. taste of vacation life. Yeah. We both had really busy work days today, and so like it just feels like extra good. Alright, so we also decided yes. um, yeah. that so Megan and Katie offered because Tiffany and Sarah are leaving tomorrow. Mm -hmm. They offered us to stay with them. Saturday night and Sunday night and we th originally thought yes we're gonna do that but after thinking about it more for us to spend Sunday night just to wake up and like me go to the office Sarah drop me off at the office and Sarah go home to Eve like we might as well like we're gonna stay as late as we can Sunday like post park close even maybe after park close go back to the room and hang out but like we figure then like let them have their morning to like get ready to go back to Ohio let us not have Eve spend not alone but like Eve doesn't sleep with Matt and Ben right. when She's, we're not home. They they said they would take care of her for sure. Yeah, but like that's not like they're gonna be letting Eve sleep with them in their bed like she does with us. Right. So we just said like we're gonna I'm gonna wake up, do my my half marathon that I'm running tomorrow for training, throw out the edit the vlog. We'll figure out what we're gonna do with the live stream and then we'll come and just be on vacation for basically yeah. two days, Until but just spend like, one like night Sunday here. Night. Yeah. Yeah. There's so many boats out right now, and our goal this weekend is to ride a boat. Which I know that a boat goes to the hotel, so it's gonna happen. I get nervous, and when I get nervous, I start twisting my fingers and my toes. <laughs> Why are you nervous? Because I'm just excited to see them. Yeah, and, and it's I'm a excited fun to like, be on their terms in their world because they're both like they're like 50/50 Disney Universal. Yeah. And we're staying with them tomorrow night, and we're gonna be in Universal. We've never been to Universal with them. Well, you just, have. You went to Halloween Horror Nights. But that's so. different. Plus, Adrian, Adrian is so soon, yeah. so excited. Yeah, Besides, Adrian really Jen at one night. I'm walking around my white tee because I'm trying to appropriately change. <laughs> Casually, our friends are famous. Oh, thank you. Uh, thank you, Mike. Thank you. City walk because they're famous. Look at they're famous. They're famous. Famous. <laughs> and casually, this is going on. Right Sunday next door. We're gonna get voodoo donuts. And look, I got my shirt on. Ooh, he's so fancy.
We've been here, what, like three times in the past month? Yeah. It's becoming our new jam. Megan's naughty. Have you, Megan been on the vlog? I don't think Megan's been in the vlog officially. It's Megan. She's my favorite. Hi, She's my favorite Megan Peaches. Oh, you. I was gonna say Peaches, but you're not like you I'm guys. Not the only one. Yeah, you're not the only one. Not like Tigger. No. <laughs> T.I. Double Gur. Thank you. So <laughs> <laughs> but I loved everything about it. <laughs> Look at all these pink boxes. There's Meg's voodoo donut. Two voodoo dolls. And then Peter's OBD. It's so good. I think it's OBD. And then I got the Portland cream. Whoa, whoa, we whoa. <laughs> What, what a, a night. cool event. Yeah. Like little you think there was like 30 people? Mina. Yeah. About? It was a good crowd. Um, I'm at, I spent most of my evening talking to two gentlemen. One's actually a teacher here in Rollins, who here, teaches choir. Like, it's called Rollins College. Rollins College. Yes, it's the college that actually Mr. Rogers went to. And apparently there's like a huge mural of him in one of like the theaters, or like the musical schools, like, like lobby. Oh, so cool. that's like where Mr. Rogers went to school. So that's cool. And it's here just in Winter Park where we want to live. And then the other guy has a farm in East Tennessee and he's like urban farming and trying to spread news about sustainability. So me and him were talking about like how or what he could do to like have like a website or a newsletter or an Instagrammer or a vlog or some way to like teach about his process of like he just this past summer, he was getting a master's and decided to become an urban farmer all at the same time. He's like, huh. probably super stupid about all the stuff I was taking mm -hmm. on, but we were talking about like sustainability and what he was going to school. It was and a then cool I, night. I was talking to a lot, like I was kind of like bouncing around a lot, but because like we know Megan and Katie so well, like we feel like we know Tiffany and Sarah. And so like, I was really happy that I was able to actually talk to them because I listen to the podcast and I know about their lives and stuff. So it was really cool to, to see him and we're just gonna have to go to Ohio. I think so. <laughs> All right, now we gotta go home to Eve. We're home and off he goes to run. 11.30, Goodbye. 11.37 p.m. Put a comment down below if, you've got, if you know some good, these things, bands, sweatpants. They're too sweaty from? They're just like thick and not the best. They don't like, on my outdoor long runs, like they get so full of sweat that it drips. I'll do the message. You do this. This puppy is so sleepy. Don't mind my red lipstick being taken off. Um, when we walked in the door, she was literally on her bed, on her back, feet up. So exhausted. Happy birthday to my godmother, Jackie. Smooth seas do not make skillful sailors. Proverb. We're tough, right, Eve? Eve, we're tough, right? Yeah. It's good to be home from us, two Brookhart girls. All right, look at that hairdo. Um, I think Sarah signed off, or maybe she did. All I know is I'm supposed to sign off. Just got done with my four mile run. It's about 12.30 in the morning. I need to take a quick shower and go to bed because I need to wake up and do my long run in the morning because then we're gonna go park at World Pacific and hang out in Universal and with Megan and Katie, it's gonna be so great. I have to sneeze. Excuse me. Anyway, I feel good. Got my four miles in. Tomorrow's my long, I switched my long run to Saturday so that I don't have to run at all while we're with Megan and Katie. It'll be great. It'll be an early morning. It'll be a busy day, super exciting day, hanging out with two of our best friends. So thank you for following along with us. If you haven't, if Sarah didn't mention it, go check out, if you're a Harry Potter fan, check out Swish and Flick, a Harry Potter podcast. The four girls that were there tonight, it's their podcast. It is a labor of love. They're amazing at it, and it's incredible. And they're wonderful people. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>